good morning students we have completed our three units now we are going to start our fourth unit that is physical education and sports for cwsn means children with special needs in this lecture we are going to see some objectives uh, concept of disability and disorder types of disability their causes and nature types of disorder their causes and nature in modern world every differently abled individual has the right to participate in the programs of physical education and sports sports for differently abled are played by individual with the disability including physical activities and intellectual disabilities nowadays sports for differ differently abled individual are organized officially these are called organized sports for the sports person with a disability which is generally divided into three main disability group first one is the deaf second one is persons with physical disabilities and person with intellectual disabilities physical education and sports provide ample opportunities to differently abled person to lead a fruitful and energetic life we will start our first point that is concept of disability and disorder there is no one uh, of this planet who does does not want to be a physical fit mentally alert socially well adjustable and emotionally balanced every individual wants to remain healthy and attain harmonious development we all want to enjoy life which is full of joy and pleasure however there are pro uh, pro people who are unable to meet their desire due to the disability or disorder generally it is seen that these two words disability and disorder are used interchangeably however it is not right so it is essential to understand the exact meaning of these two terms according to world health organization a disability is a restriction of lack of ability to perform an activity in the manner of within the range considered normal for a human being disability is an important that may be developmental intellectual mental physical sensory or uh, some combinations of this it substantially affect on person a life activities and may be present from birth or occur during a person of lifetime it means that is an important that create obstructions and normal functions or movements of an individual it limit and restrict the activities of a person concept of disability there are many types of disabilities that affects uh, a person uh, vision movements thinking remembering learning communicating hearing mental health social relationship now we will turn to see what is disorder disorder is usually used for mental disabilities disorder is any element that disturb the health of an any individual disorder create disturbance in individuals performance and reduce his efficiency most probably disorder cannot be de uh, detected on time as a result of which a um, simple disorder is change into a disability it can be said that a disorder disrupt the normal function of an individual disorder can be defined as a blip in the usual functioning of a person now we will see the types of disability their causes and nature disability occurs to indi individual in many ways and with varied severity there are three types of disabilities such as cognitive disability intellectual dis disability and physical disability now we'll see type of disability first one is cogn cognitive disability cognition refers to understanding the ability to understand what you see and hear and to infer information for a social cause and body language people with this impairment may have trouble learning new things the generalization from one situation to another and expressing themselves through spoken or written language learning difficulties can cause difficulties in reading writing or mathematics generally the individual who have this type of disability Uh, usually have uh, some symptoms like memory disorder hyperactivities dyslexia 
and attention deficiency of hyperactivity disorder like means ADHD. Now we will see intellectual disability. Intellectual disability is a disability characterized by uh, significant limitations both uh, in intellectual functioning. If a person has an intellectual disability, their brain hasn't developed uh, properly or has been injured in some way. Their brain may be also not function within the normal range of both intellectual and adaptive functioning in the past. Medical professional called these conditions mental retardation. It also include psychiatric disability which is related to the individual social disabilities such as behavior, emotions and thinking. The intellectual disability begins before the age of 18 years. I will see physical disability. A physical disability is a limitations on an individual physical functioning, mobility, dyslexia or uh, stamina. There are many different causes of phys uh, physical disabilities, but they can include inherited or genetic disorders, serious illness and injury. Now we will see the two major categories of physical disabilities are the muscular skeleton disability and the second is the neuromuscular disability. Now we will see the causes of disability, uh, genetic causes, poverty, mental health problem, accidents, infection diseases, disturbance in endurance uh, gladder, uh, malnutrition, poor approach to health care, nuclear accidents, toxic material, pesticide, illness, lack of education, wars, medicine and vaccines and last one is uh, dangerous working environment. Now we will see nature of disability. The understanding of disabilities from medicine definition explain the nature and characterize of different forms of disability. There are two type of, type of disabilities. One is physical and communication disabilities and another is mental, learning and medical disabilities. In first disabilities, there are visual imp uh, impairment, blindness, person with low vision, hearing impairment and and locomotor impairment and uh, in second uh, disability there are mental uh, psychological illness mental uh, retardation learning disability multiple disability and medical disabilities this is all for today's lecture remaining part we will see in our next lecture okay bye take care